way how I go, how, how I build my businesses here, yeah, all, most of these businesses, I know nothing at the beginning. I learn. Like I learn my English. How do I learn my English? I do not have formal education. During 70s, I buy Time magazine. I bought uh, 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 Life, because at that time Life is quite popular during 70s. So I have a one dictionary, Chinese English. During flight, read, read. At home, have spare time, read. I cannot pronounce properly, but I can read, understand the word. That's how I starting from. And then after I, I, I do the business at a certain stage, so I think my management theory, I need to learn some management theory. This reason why my first business school is in Xi'an. So I went to Fontainebleau, stayed there for three months, just newly married, bring my wife. Actually, I want my wife to, because she always had me go together in 1980 to, because we just married. I say, and then we are, we are trying to register with Philippe Lasse. Philippe Lasse, eh, no, husband, wife cannot, you know. I said, my wife is executive of a secret business, Indo Cafe and so on. I said, no, 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 no. Only one, okay. So my wife had to, a big holiday, and also produce a baby because they're married, yeah? And then she learned some French. So since then, every year, 1980, every year I spend two to three weeks, go to the best famous business school around the world. So in terms of a study hour by now, I think I probably qualify for MBA, although I have not any formal education. <laughs> yeah, but every year, you no, know, two, three weeks, when you calculate you are growing for 30 years and you probably have 90 weeks. Huh? Uh, recently, I went so close. I went to Harvard. Last year I went to Harvard, this year I go to Harvard. But at 2000, why sometimes you lead, I'm also Walton, Walton alumni, I took off from business for six months. I go to two business school. One is Kellogg in Northwestern and a Walton. I joined the Walton uh, this is a, uh, why, why is the famous uh, uh, e-commerce professor? Jerry Wynn. Uh, Jerry Wynn. So I went to Jerry Wynn, the e, uh, uh, e-fellowship, so fellowship program. So that's why I say, oh, after your fellowship, you're qualified as an alumni. So that's how I start. I want to answer one thing. Because in the business, in the real world, when the value of company, what I understand at that time, 2000, is the value of company is a function of cash flow time. This value or discount factor. I said, what the hell this dot-com business? I went to 1998, 99, I need money. I go to Wall Street, he said, Sukanto, if you need money, only TNT. I said, what TNT? Technology and telecom. You can raise the money. After that, you forget it. So I say, and then I look at TNT, say, this person, some of them even losing money. But they sell eyeball. Remember the eyeball? They sell eyeball. You have many eyeball, more valuable. So, oh, okay. Uh, sounds similar. You see now what happened dot com. <laughs> so uh, eyeball. But then, if you're negative cash flow, how can the value is double zero? Infinity. That's why I learned. So in, in, in Kellogg, I asked the same question. In Wharton, financial professor, at the end of the day, I don't get exact answer. I just, three. <laughs> <laughs> Even financial professor at oh, you see, 19 or something, Ford Motor, and so on. There's many companies, automobile, you see Ford, and a few years later, General Motor, and so Chrysler. <laughs> I say, it's a dream. And that's why people feel a dream. Like today, Alibaba, blah, blah, blah. blah. I say, dream. <laughs> it may be true. Yeah? But this reason I still don't understand. So that's where I try to learn. And, but since then, I go to business school. I go to uh, London School of Economy, LSE. I went to INSEAD. I went to IMD. 
uh, in, in before I'm the Imide, uh, and then uh, I went to Chicago, Kellogg, Stanford, uh, uh, Wharton, Harvard. Uh, which one I have? I, uh, oh, UC Berkeley, UCLA. That's how. That's how my exposure. So some school I go back more frequently. Some school after one time I say, okay, I understand. Why. <laughs> yeah. So if you want me to value business school, I probably am in the right position to value to give you some advice. If the next time you want to find another business school to get PhD, I probably can give you some advice. <laughs>